Yes, Lorio. Good evening. Hello. Hello. Hello, hello. How are you? I'm not quite. Okay, that's good to hear. So, how's your evening? It's a dumb, quite mm -hmm. Okay, so are you done eating your dinner? Yes, I'm done. Oh, I see. So now, since we are done to our last discussion, so now let's proceed to the unit 29. So what do you think our lesson this evening? What? What, uh, what do you think our, our lesson this evening? Lesson to discuss. What do you think? To shop today. I don't know. Okay. So, are you ready to listen and answer the activity with this uh, lesson? But, yes, I'm ready. All right. So, now let's proceed. So, our lesson this evening is all about Unit 29, We're in the Toy Shop Today. And by the way, before that, I forgot. Um, You forgot to send uh, or to answer your homework, which what? is Unit 30. I sent it already on our GC. Your homework, which is unit 30. Because. Um, um, just do it and uh, we will going to check that on uh, at our next meeting, okay? Okay. Okay, so now let's continue. Unit 29, we're in the toy shop today. So now let's proceed. Okay, vocabulary. Can you repeat vocabulary? Vocabulary. Okay. So now here we are. Vocabulary. This is a doll. Okay, this is a doll. 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 And Doll. this one, this is a floor. floor. Okay, floor. Floor. And this one, the third one is toy. 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 Okay, toy. So now, do you have any question regarding this picture? No. Okay, so know. since you don't have any question, let's proceed. Okay, so have you remember our last discussion? It's all about preposition, right? We discuss it. The preposition, right? Yes. Okay, so now here we are again. Preposition of place. So now, the ball inside the um, or the I'm ball done. in the, the box. box. How about this one? The ball on the box. On the box. And the third one? The ball under the box. Okay. The ball under the box. And the fourth one? 
the ball next to the box. Okay, the ball next to the box. How about this one? The behind. The ball behind. The ball behind the box. And this one? This one. Oh, sorry. This one. The ball in Between front the box. of the box. Okay. And the last one. What is the last one? The ball. Between the box. Okay. The ball between the box. Okay. So remember this one. Okay. In, on, under, next to, behind, in front of, and between. Okay. 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 So since you don't have any question, let's proceed. Okay, so we are in the activity. So look at the picture and complete the sentence. Complete the sentences. So now you're going to answer the number two until seven. Okay. So there is one example. There is one. Okay. There is some pizza and the box. So now you're going to answer number two and number seven. Okay. Just observe the pictures in order to answer. And if you have any question or clarification, just ask me. Are you ready? Okay, I'm ready. Pardon? Yes, I'm ready. Okay, that's good to hear. And you may now start answering.
And I go to Natalie. Pardon? Can I go to the toilet? Okay. Can I go to the toilet? Okay. Yeah. Hello, are you done? Yeah. Okay, so you may now continue answering the activity, okay? Okay. So, are you sure we will answer number two and number seven? Can you check the yes. spell? What? The spelling of number two. Your answer number two. Between. Then, can you correct the spelling of this? Can you see okay. it? This one. You saw it. Are you sure? This one between the spell of between. Yes. Are you sure? Yes. Okay. Yes, so now let's see if your answer is correct. So can you can you read the question number or uh, the sentence number two? There is a guitar between the lamp and the flat. Okay, there is a guitar between the lamp and the plant. Okay, let's see if your answer is correct. Oh, your answer here is wrong because the correct spell of between is double, double E. Right? Can you see it? B E T yeah. W E E and N. Okay, so now let's proceed to number three. There are two dogs under the table okay so let's see if your answer here is correct okay very good you have a correct answer so let's proceed to number four can you read the the is a window behind the sofa okay the um uh, the there is a window behind the sofa okay let's see if your answer is correct okay very good you have correct answer now so now let's proceed to number five can you read it again okay there is a rock in front of sofa Okay, okay, you have the right, correct answers. And then let's proceed to number six. Number six, rather. 
Can you read? Can you read the number six? Is in the blood. Okay, there is a rocket next to the bug. Okay, now let's see. Okay, very good. And now number seven. There is some cheese in the plate. Are you sure that your answer here is correct? And the plate? Yes. Okay, yes. now let's see if your answer here is correct. Oh, your answer here is wrong. The correct answer here is on. There is some cheese on the plate. Okay, so all in all, you have four over six. Okay, very good because you try your best to answer this one. So, 4 over 6. Mm -hmm. So, very good. Okay, so do you have any question or clarification? No, I don't have. Are you sure? Because we have a lot of activities to do after this one. Yes. yes. Okay, so since you don't have any question, let's proceed. Okay, starters tip. In reading and writing part 5, you answer different questions that might begin with what, where, which, who, what, what color, how many, and make sure you understand what information each question is asking for. Okay, so now let's proceed. Okay, so we are now in part A. Answer the questions. Okay, so the first question is, do you like going to toy shops? Do you like? Yes. Yes. Oh, I see. So, why do, uh, who do you go with? With your? I go with my mom and dad. Okay, with your mom and dad. How about, do you play with some toys or games at home? Yes. Mm-hmm. What kind of toys or games? You have a lot of toys or games at home? What? Do you have any toys or games at home? Yes. Mm -hmm. What kind of toys? I don't know. You don't have any toys because you don't know. No, I don't remember. <laughs> I don't remember. Okay, I see. So what's your favorite toy or game? Your favorite one? My favorite like, uh, oh. As I remember, your favorite uh, game you have is the chess. Chess, right? Uh, yes, chess. And this, in this, but I draw to you. The chess, right? And what? This. I like uh, chess and I like play. Mm-hmm. Okay. What 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 Okay, very good. So now, mm -hmm. you like playing that one?
Draw. Okay. So, do you like playing that one? Yes. And it's what? Okay, so now you play we... with me. Wait, you play with me. You. Mm hmm. <laughs> okay, so now let's continue our lesson this evening. Okay, so do you have any question regarding this one? No, I don't have. Okay, so since you don't have any questions, so let's proceed to the next slide. Okay, so now we are in part A. Look at the pictures and answer the questions. So, what can you see in the picture? What can you see in the picture? I can see the toy shop. Okay, you can uh you see a toy shops. Okay. Okay, now, so let's proceed. Okay, so find seven things in the picture that start with C. Can you say it? Can you see uh, five, uh, five things that start with letter C? Chair. Chair. Cat. Cat. Clock. Clock. Chaser. Okay. What else? You have four. Is cupboard. Cupboard. Okay. What else? Cupboard. And then. Crocodile. Crocodile. Okay, what else? The last one. What? Seven. Seven things. No. One, two, one. three, four, five, six. Six, rather. There. What? The car is seven. You don't see. Okay, the car. And then what else? That's all? The crocodile, the cat, chair, cupboard, cat. Okay. So now, what toys can you see? Can you see okay. all this one? Can you say what toys they are? It's a lorry, a crocodile. Crocodile, what else? Truck or lorry? Airplane? And then? A car? Um, mm -hmm. A ball? Balloon?
Okay, very good. So now let's proceed to the next question. So, is the shop open? What do you think? The shop is closed. Okay, the shop is closed. Why? Because the man is cleaning, right? Can you say that one? The shop is closed because the man is cleaning. Okay, so now let's proceed. Okay, what color is the cat? What color? The cat is white. Okay, the color of the cat is white. Okay, so now, so what's on the floor between the man and the woman? What's on the floor between the man and the woman? What is that? It's a box of toys. Okay, a box of toys. Okay, so how many chairs can you see? How many chairs? Chairs on the picture. There are I can see two chairs. Two, two. chairs. Okay, there are two chairs. Okay, now so do you have any question regarding this one? This slide? No. Okay, so since you don't have any questions, so let's proceed. Okay, so we are now in part A, which is the activity. Write one, one word answers. Okay, so here is the example. How many toys are in the big cupboard? So there are 12 um, toys in the big cupboard. And then what is the man cleaning? The floor. So the man cleaning on the floor. So number one. You're going to answer this one. The number one, two, and three. Then you're just going to observe <clears throat> the picture, okay? Okay. Okay, so now you may, uh, you may now start answering. And if you have a question, just ask me. What is your answer number one? Is a ball. Okay, so can you write your answer here in the blank? I can't see my pain. Are you sure? Yes. Okay, so I'll be the one we are going to write your answer here. You see in the screen. Yes, what is that? This is a pen. This is a pen, not a pen. What? Pardon, what is that? You see, quite, this is very great diamond. Mm -hmm, great diamond. Okay, so now, what is your answer number two? Number two, how many people are in the shop now? There are... How many people? Uh, I, they are. Well, it's 12. Are you sure that there are 12? Yeah. Can you count it it's again? 12.
Yes, there are eleven. Okay, eleven. And then number three, what are the two of the children sitting on? Sitting on the what? Sitting on the horse. Okay. So now let's see if your answer here is correct. Okay, so wait for a while. So your hands answer here is your answer here horse is cost. Okay, now let's going to check your answer your answer number one which toy is the woman holding your answer here is a ball okay very good you have a correct answer how about number two how many people are in the shop now your answer here is 11 are you sure that there are 11 people yes Okay, so now let's see. Okay, very good. You have two correct answers. So number three, what are the two of the children sitting on? A horse? Okay, very good. You have three correct answers. And you have a perfect score in this slide. So do you have any question? Regarding uh, this one? No, I don't have a question. Okay, so since you don't have any question, let's proceed. Okay, so here's uh the number four and number five. Uh, write one word answer. Okay, so you're going to look at the picture and observe. Then and you're going to answer this one, the four and five. Can you do that? What is the man in the shop doing? Okay, now let's see if your answer here is correct. So your answer number four, where are the toys now? On the car, are you sure? Let's see. Okay, very good. Your answer here is correct. So what is the man in the shop doing? Sleeping? Okay, very good. So all in all, you've got five over five. Because in the last... uh slide you've got three and plus two all in all you've got five over five very good so now do you have any question regarding this activity no i don't have okay since you don't have any questions so let's proceed okay so part a Let's tell the story now. So, this is Mr. and Mrs. Holmes' toy. 
So in the morning, Mr. Holmes cleaned the floor and Mrs. Holmes put, put toys in the big cupboard. Can you see that one? In the yeah. morning, Mr. Holmes cleaning the floor and then Mrs. Holmes put the toys in the big cupboard. Can you see the first mm -hmm. picture? Okay, so do you have any question? The picture no, number one. Okay, so now let's proceed. Okay, so part B asked and answer questions about the toys in picture number two. So which toy is next to the window? 